الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم في وسط فقول يا ولد لايت وبارك وبنازل بيتي ان اول فيو الحقيقه انا مش عارف استمتع حضراتكم بمحاضره في ميتولوجي في مؤتمر زي ده لكن ان شاء الله تكون حاجه مفيده وكويسه Uh, our book is uh, about integration between Oxygena and the new monologist uh, as a cornerstone in the reduction of neonatal mortality and uh, mortality and morbidity. Usually, I, uh, I like to start with this uh, picture, uh, which summarizes the special relationship between this tiny uh, delicate newborn and his uh, doctor. Briefly, uh, I will mention the worldwide neonatal mortality rate in the previous uh, century, uh, by the year uh, 1900, it was 150 million uh, pairs. It is reduced uh, dram dramatically in the middle of the century to 50, uh, and now it is four uh, as regarding the developed countries. Uh, this market reduction uh, was, parallel, uh, was parallel to the development and the establishment of neontology. Uh, John Lewis uh, made the first incubator by the year uh, uh, 1857, the, the first neonatal department, the, department. Uh, the uh, first half of the 20th century uh, was the golden age for neonatology, for example, established linkage between RH isomerization and electroplastosis vitalis. Uh, by the year 1942, and the first exchange transfusion, the umbilical vein as treatment for glossoplastosis vitalis by the year 1946. Uh, a dark age emerges, uh, all of us known about the uh, thalidomide catastrophe by the year 1957. Uh, uh, the year 1963 was the actual uh, delivery uh, for neonatal intensive care units. Uh, 34 weeks uh, uh, gestation baby, 2.1 kilogram, uh, died from RDS. His name was Patrick Kennedy, the son of uh, the US uh, uh, President John Kennedy. Kennedy's experience spared the Western world to find a cure for RDS. Nowadays, with the combination of pulse oximetry, uh, gentle uh, ventilation strategies, and the completion of uh, artificial surfactants, we go from saving new term infant to reducing down the survival limits to the second trimester. Responsibility is divided between parents, uh, obstetrician, and neurologists who, re who reduce the morbidity and the mortality rate. Three examples for integration of perinatal care as regarding material risk factors uh, which lead to neonatal uh, infection, drugs and substances taken during the pregnancy, material medical condition associated with risk for neonatal death. First case scenario, this is Ahmed Ashraf male was admitted to our unit at day five of life with extensive facial scan lesion, neonatal jaundice, Stabilization was done in parallel investigations of the goals and the meticulous history was taken. But dramatically, baby developed cyanosis, hemopsis, cardiogenic shock, and the baby was missed. History reveals that mother had skin rash two days before delivery. Investigation results that show the Zoscar Oscar viral infection. Ahmed would be saved uh, if good integration was done uh, by giving uh, 0.5 ml varicella zoster immunoglobin and a cytoglobin for the baby. Uh, as you know, infection accounts for 48% of neonatal deaths, and this is a long list of maternal risk factors which lead to vertical neonatal infection. The diagnostic approach for uh, congenital infection. Second case. Hany Maggit male was admitted to our unit at day one uh, with extensive GIT bleeding, power convulsions. Stabilization was done in the form of anti shock measures, vitamin K, fresh, fresh frozen plasma, and back, back RBCs. Uh, simultaneously, investigations of the cause and sequence was done. Meticulous history was taken. Baby was diagnosed as hemorrhagic disease of newborn, early type, 
and the mother was on anticonvulsant during the pregnancy. CT brain revealed the obstructive hydrocephalus due to intraventricular hemorrhage, which indicated the periculobicromial chunk. Hany could be saved if good integration was done. 10 mg vitamin D I M given to the mother 24 hours before delivery and uh, immediate management for the baby. Effects of drugs and substance taken during pregnancy there is a, a very long list. Our third case, Wafa was uh, a 26 years old pregnant female with SLE while performing ultrasound on a 31 week fetus and obstetrician was noting that the fetal heart rate ranged from 62 to 66 feet per minute, fetal growth was normal, and no structural cardiac anomalies are identified. Contact to cardiologist and arrangement for any pacemaker implantation was done after a period of stabilization in the NICU. Shagina is three years old and his growth is within normal. Uh, Shadi is an, a good, is an example for good integration. Important maternal medical conditions and associated risk fetus for new needs. In the fact, we are in the hospital, we will try to be a series of cases for you, like the cases of the cases of infertility. And I'm sure that Dr. Hisham, the word of the word is that اي الطائل لا يطيق الا الجناحين حضراتكم الجناح واحنا لازم نبقى الجناح الثاني عشان نعدي بحلم الاب والام ان هم يبقى عندهم مش بس بيبي لكن كمان بيبي سليم احنا في جالنا نيكيو المورتاليتي انسنس عندنا 0.42 و الموتاليتي انسدنس عندنا 4.2 مع العلم ان الرقم الشيب الرسمي في مصر هو اراوند 12 وده الرغم ان احنا ان النيميتس البريماتيور عندنا بيمثلوا 47% يعني تقريبا النص الكباستي بتاعتنا في جالنا ليكيوز هي 10 9 بيتس Four with mechanical ventilators, four with nasal CPAP, and one for intensive phototherapy. In short, Allah, we are in the future. We are hoping to increase this capacity and double the number of machines incubated. In short, Allah, with the help of the Chairman and the Chairman of the Committee, we will in short, Allah, by the help of God, we will complete the whole machine. Thank you.